Try to roll my tongue in. I'm sorry. Steve, if I'm being too much, you can let me know right now. No, no, you're perfect the way you are, Edwin. Zachary. Uh -huh. Dude, <laughs> he's reassuring me yeah. more than my ex did. Is this rolling? We're, we're rolling. All right. Oh, Welcome fuck. back to number two. Part with, two, yeah. With the boys. Um, speaking of part two, Zach went number two in the pool, pool. in his first episode. If you guys I missed did. it. And my turd floated in the water. <laughs> if you missed and it. And I ate it. <laughs> if you missed it, go check out He's part one lying. with the boys. Um, we're back with number two, like I just said. And we have more confessions. My <laughs> ex was cheating, so I sent him a tip. I sent in a tip Whoa. to the cops <laughs> hey, hold on about now. his drug dealing, and I got him arrested. What kind of tip we talking as, about? As you should, sister. <laughs> yeah, hey, as, as you, you should. should. That's Do good. If you, get che if you get cheated on, fuck that motherfucker. <laughs> Go Fact. go to jail, bitch. You deserve to go to jail for cheating. Fuck yeah, you um, should. Okay, now, that should be now, a now thing. we're pushing In it a little Michigan, bit. In Michigan, did you know it's illegal to cheat on your husband and wife? Really? Yep. What happens if you cheat on them? You, you go, go to, to jail. jail. That should be a law everywhere. For how long? I don't know. It's, just a, it's just a law. I'm moving to Michigan. Yeah, Fuck that. Yeah, fact check me, Steve. It is a weird law about Michigan. Dude. Well, that should hey, be a thing everywhere. anybody out there that wants to live in Michigan... Hit my lineup. Isn't it? Isn't cheat. that weird, Steve? While some argue the law is archaic, adultery is considered a felony in Michigan. A felony, wow. bro. A wow. felony. As it fucking should. Not even a misdemeanor. Pop your shit, twin. I got rejected by a girl I liked, then I made a fake account and I bought her nudes. Same. You, <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> First off, you didn't have to make a new account I'm, to buy yeah, her nudes. Oh, I guess kidding. you do have to. Wait, what are we talking about? On what? Oh, yeah. On OF? Probably. This man's on the OF. Buy the news. See, I actually don't even have an account, like to like even buy anything or look yeah. at anybody's things. Uh, yeah, me either. What? Check That's... out Zach's OnlyFans link in bio. Link in bio, please, guys. We're going up almost at forty thousand subs. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Actually. Oh, yeah, it's <laughs> oh my god, yeah. so guess what? Dinner on him again. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Um, we, we have a rotation actually. We do. That's... Guess, who, guess who's today? Me. Jordan. Jordan's buying lunch today after this. Yep, I am. So, what do you guys have to say about that? I'll be real with you. I got short term memory loss. What was the confession? <laughs> short term memory loss. My name is Dory. Yeah, get the fuck out. Let's get the fuck out of here. What the fuck was that? Is this what the fuck you brought us to? Is this your goddamn... What is this? I like Dory. No, Dory's great. Can I see the confession again? I'm sorry. We're dragging I got rejected by a girl I liked that I made a fake account and I bought nudes for her from her. I think it's pretty baller, honestly. Like, if you want something in life, you got to keep fighting Hell until no. you get what you want. <laughs> that's true. That's really? True. That's not what you were telling me earlier. I don't like to stop till I get what I want. You that's that's no, not what you were telling me no, earlier. No, because that's different because you you know what you want, and you're do, you're going against what you want. You're doing the opposite of what you should nah, be doing. Now, let's talk about something. First of all, if you ha you're, nobody's a baller if you have to buy that person's nudes. You're a baller if you get them for free. Steps to sir type of vibe, would you ever? Um, yeah, yeah, because it's not like blood related, so it doesn't count. Fact. You, run, you running through that shit, basically? You running through oh, that? Yes, I, I, go. Oh my God. I'm your stepbrother. Sleeping with my hot manager on my job, I'm a hostess. Honestly, I respect that because then she probably gonna get a pay raise or some shit. So. But also, as soon as you don't like him and you stop fucking him, that's when you get fired. Oh, facts. I didn't think about it like that. So that, then you're gonna be stuck in something. Wait, maybe that's the a bad whole thing. like co worker, employee world is tricky. Like, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't go there. No, I must say, That's like going to F everything up for you, to be honest. It's I'm going to say this like right now. I, I don't think I could, after all these stories that I've heard and, and just LA, how it fucks your, your head up of how cheating and everything goes, I shit you not, I don't think I could date a girl that works a job. <laughs> This motherfucker can't even date a human at this point. No, 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 dead ass. Because can't have an ex or can't have a job. <laughs> <laughs> because think about it. A tree. The motherfuckers are gonna have a a, a work boyfriend. You want you a girl? Your girl talk about her work boyfriend? You don't know if they fucking back there. Oh, facts. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, that's about. what I'm saying. Oh, like, the work break and shit. A lot of people like Damn, it it's probably like, is low key. The whole coworker thing. Like a lot of people have affairs <laughs> with their coworkers. Right. Because they, like, spend so much time yeah, together. Yeah, exactly. A lot more time they spend with you because they're, they're at, at work, work all, all day. day. It's like they're sneaky link. Mm. Except much. they're at something. Yeah, bro, fuck all. See, fuck, fuck this world right now, bro. It's so fucked. There's, cheating is just such a big thing right now. Shut your simp ass up, all man. Right. God damn. <clears throat> I'm just loyal to the game. <laughs> I'm in love. I am too. I'm in love with my best friend, but I'm scared to tell her I don't want to ruin our friendship. Tell her. Tell her. Why not? Listen. Ooh, lately, no, 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 no. Lately, life, we have realized 
a lot more lately that it's it's yep. very short. Do not keep things in. If you want somebody, go for it. And guess what? If it, if it doesn't if it doesn't like go the way you want it, then that's okay. That means that person was not meant to be for you. Yeah. So just move. And also, I'm, I feel like that situation sometimes doesn't always like completely end the like the friendship. Like I yeah. feel like it might be like a little awkward at first, I, but I'll, like over time, I'm sure like things will like resolve themselves. And like, I yeah. I read um, that the number elderly people they they did like a study where they were asked. Um, like top five things that they regret in their life, and number one was they regret not expressing their feelings to a person. You know, I also That's saw a study. Number one, not like saw. not it's one of the scariest things to do. I feel like in I saw a study to express how you feel. To I people. saw a study about elderly people at nursing homes, and um, that all they do there is fuck. That's I. I was at like, the nursing the homes. That's all they at, do. The STD I heard that from rate you. At, yeah, the STD rate is the highest. How the fuck at, you know all this? A nursing home, mainly. She spit she's, some like she's, like facts that like you gotta, yeah fact check that Steve fact check us especially <laughs> during COVID the rates went up for STDs yeah hey, there ain't nothing to do but fuck home. there's nothing to do but fuck you trying can't go, go anywhere to, trying to go to nursing home boy what I've been there already look how high the yeah. rates are all right he's about to talk no apparently there's been historically high rates of STIs among older Americans uh, since pretty much uh, quarantine has started told you wow. Oh, wow. I only spit facts. You should always say how you feel. Always. And don't let that... I hate how people say, like, let things go. Like, the cliche of, like, let them go, they'll, they'll come back to you, or whatever. I, this has nothing to do with that. But I think you should always uh, fight for what you want and, and, and get what you want. Because then you're going to regret it not giving it your all when you could have. And you, <sighs> you'll, you'll think about it always as, it could have been this if I just did that. So just do everything that you can, and if it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. Don't be upset especially about it. like, like what what they said. Like they've been learning a lot, like recently about like losing people and like seeing life without people, and probably like regretting things or like not like seeing if someone like means a lot to you. Like make sure they know and like stuff like that. But if if you cannot live without like a person in your life you might as well just be open and honest with them, especially if they're, like... Especially if you guys are best friends, I feel like. I if you guys her. are, like, friends, I would I would say that's tricky. But, like, especially if you just have an understanding with someone and you're best friends, no one is going to relate more or understand you more than your best friend. I should, I I should call her, bro. Uh, yeah, I'm finna say, call her right now. Her. I've thought about Zach while having sex with my boyfriend. Wait, is this like an influencer or this is a fan? Because if, if a, this is somebody we know, that's fucking crazy. That would be pretty fucking baller. I mean, that's what? my boy. You Except poor guy, the boyfriend. Poor guy, yeah, you're poor a piece guy. of shit, dude. Yeah, she she came to me. Yo, she that's, face fucked. She face that's, fucked. That's another thing that's scary, bro. That girls could be thinking of another. Dude, you'll never know. What's well, both ways though? The guy could be thinking of a, of a different girl. Hell yeah, I'll be thinking about my grandma. It was same. My auntie got got it going on. I've watched my mom and dad <laughs> have sex while I enjoyed a nice steak dinner. What? This motherfucker had a full course dinner right here, watching his mom and dad fuck. Watching his dad just rail that little. Uh, I'm just so glad that when we're talking, there's not like speakers that we're coming out of because everybody in this whole. They do. They uh, are. Oh, this is great. Paul, you can hear us. Oh, holy <laughs> shit. Fuck. Wow. Okay. I am so sorry for anybody listening in. Everyone is listening in. Oh, shit. I forgot. <laughs> uh, we sincerely apologize. All right. I lost my virginity in a forest behind the elementary school. Why didn't you just go somewhere else? That's like my... Why did you go there? Wait, were they in elementary? Or is this... And... That's a valid question. <laughs> Dude, and, and when I lived in Alaska, motherfuckers were doing crazy ass shit in elementary, bro. I shit you not. Yeah, you can get in like really big trouble behind an elementary. School. I think it's because it's like it's like an adrenaline rush. It's like, oh my god, we shouldn't be here doing this right now. So it's like, fuck. That was so hot. This let's go so do hot. it. Yeah. Me and you, let's go. Yeah. What? I mean, here's one for you. No, I want to read them. Yeah. I regret getting those tattoos of Zach's face and name. Yo, <laughs> these okay. are fucking I'll just crazy. Shoot myself. I hooked up with my ex and got pregnant, so we started dating again. And now we're engaged. <laughs> this is gonna be me and my ex. He's not lying. Jesus, though. fuck! Here, take the fucking phone, dude. I just read something. I didn't know it water read. Where's the That's one of not, me? I no. Stop. Okay, I'm not looking for that. I'm not looking for that. No, just give okay, I got one. 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 Sit down. I got one. What do you gotta hide? What's the like? What's just hug. See, now she not. I don't even know how it feels when you grab my phone. I get scared. I want someone to face fuck me. 
Put I'm me. be honest with you, dude. I don't know. They all say I want to jerk off to you, so I'm not sure <laughs> yeah. what to pick. At this Literally point. told you. This person once dated two girls, and then he made the decision of which to date, who was better in bed. That was his. That's the, some the, king shit. No, I'm kidding. That's some fuck. That's fucked up. Okay, so like he was dating them both, right? Like, and he decided he likes both of them equally, but. He needs what help. decided who he was going to keep yes. was who was better at bed. I don't think there's nothing wrong with that. Like, you know, they're going to be with each other for a while. It's like when you go get a car, you got to, like, test drive the car to make sure you want the car. You feel Jesus me? Jesus, fuck. <laughs> no? So Zach has test driven two vehicles. No, I've never done that. Don't, no, don't, don't, no, no. Zach has to test driven over 100 vehicles. <laughs> okay, <laughs> stop. God damn. You virgin? I'm a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> well, that wraps it up, y'all. Thank God. Anything else you guys have to say or any type of confession you got to make? <sighs> Zach, you first. Then. Be sure to thumbs up the podcast. I think my last thing to I want to say before we sign off here <clears throat> is... He said before we sign off here. Before we sign off. <laughs> Professional is, ass. I hope <laughs> you got... Damn, motherfucker. <laughs> Can we get a close-up on... Uh, yeah. Ah, yeah, ah, bitch. Ah. <laughs> Listen. Uh... No matter what is going on in your life, good fucking luck. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. Listen, you got it. All right, bye, everyone. See you next Love year. Love you. Bye, Daddy. Bye.